Hi everyone. So we're just outside in my yard. You gotta do make with what you have. I've got a whacked out yard. That's too wacky job for me to clean. So I just live here. Anyways, there's a bunch of yummy free flowers, free food. So what I did is I took some flowers who look like this because that means they're on their first opening as opposed to this one. Can you see me? Where am I here? Ah. As opposed to this one who has opened, I believe it's on about its third day. So you are going to pay attention to what flowers you're picking because you want to make sure to get the flowers who are right for picking so that's what we're gonna do you're gonna pick those and then use them right away you are oh here's another one you're gonna put oh and as you notice there is gonna be a tiny bit of a milky white substance don't be afraid that's okay because you're gonna do a light wash sorry I have a little bit of bad head still you're going to do a light wash in vinegar water and making sure that it's extremely cold, even cold to your hands. And which I already uh, washed some and I have them in my ready to go strainer. And make sure any little bugs that were in there are out. Unless you want a little more protein, you can go ahead and eat them. So I've uh, boiled some water here, nice and hot. So I'm just going to go ahead and what I do is I let it steep in this little cup that I have, which actually was an old cup from when I was doing whey powder uh, protein shakes, but now I just use the boost. But nevertheless, so here's the one we can have for tea. What I'm gonna do is mix it with some green tea, I have, which I already had this morning, but I had a fill up of it. But the tea bag steeps so well that it uh, is still strong enough. So what I'll do is I'll add some honey I will add this after about 15, 20 minutes, whenever it's finally cooled off even. Uh, so once it's cooled off, I'll go ahead and mix it together and make a nice iced tea, a dandelion flower iced tea. And it is so beneficial and nutritious. Some of the things that it is good for, and some people even say that it's known to cure, is I hope that I'm not getting too much of a glare here. What's going on? Uh, okay. I'd like to be getting these in the picture, but okay. Anyways, so uh, dandelion has been um, studied for liver disease, colitis, immune health, influenza, antifungal anti activity, as well as arthritis, antibacterial issues are making uh, good for antibacterial, as well as good for diabetes. Oh, my bed head. <sighs> oh, anyway. That's why you wonder why I call it Linda in the Raw, because I'm just my girlfriend. Jim Gang, get up there, fluff up, girl. My type of hair, I have to straighten it and then put curls to put body back. Weird situation. That's why I don't do my hair much either. So anyway, the other things that make this plant, the dandelion from root, to flower head, the leaves, everything are so nutritious. Uh, it contains potent antioxidants 
and it may, uh, may fight inflammation as well as aid in blood sugar, reduce cholesterol, and reduce uh, glycosteride levels. So also blood pressure, it lowers your blood pressure and promotes liver health. So those of you who like to drink, like I occasionally used to, uh, quite a bit, no, I mean, just occasionally, maybe, I don't know. Anyway, drink, eat, consume your dandelions. It is spring, y'all, it is the season. They are gonna bloom through the summer, even as far into fall, if you let them go which is fine for me. So I'm in a yard. I have great activity with wildlife here. Beautiful little creatures wandering through little rapids. I love it, I love it. So watch the video, stay tuned, and be sure to click like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for any upcoming videos of me being silly, sometimes being informative. That's my scratchy writing or other times having a sit down mukbang with you. So remember to share, cause sharing is caring and we wanna get it out there that I'm actually the girl who likes to show her uvula before and after she's eating. So with that, let me let you go ahead and subscribe right away and I will see you in the next video. So again, remember, let this go ahead and steep for at least 15-ish, 20 minutes, or at least uh, until it cools. Go ahead and mix it with another tea if you like. Otherwise, have it straight up. It may have a tinge bitter taste. So again, go ahead and put some honey or some something else. You can even put lemon if you like. But uh, again, consume it any which way you can. In the next video, I'll be showing how I mix it with some berries and make a smoothie out of the leaves. So stay tuned for that. See you soon.